Hey guys, today's video is going to be a haul video. I'm going to show you some items that I recently purchased off Poshmark. I am turning around and selling these items on Poshmark. I am not going to do them like in order by bundle because um, I did purchase quite a few bundles. Hold on, I guess I could look. I think it's like, these are like five or six bundles um, with a total of, I don't know, I don't know how many things. We can we can have a tally at the end. Um, so yeah, so I have been doing like 95% of my sourcing on Poshmark because I have a lot of credits on there. So everything, sorry if the lighting is weird by the way, and sorry if I look, if I look a mess. I'm gonna go through and show you guys some things that I purchased off Poshmark and I'm gonna turn around and sell them on Poshmark. I will have everything listed by the time this video is up, so if you're interested in anything, you can check it out in my closet. Okay, first thing I got are these shorts. These are from H&M, um, and they're just uh, white. Why is Brad Paisley texting me? I get text messages from Brad Paisley because I signed up for his uh, freaking like, newsletter thing or whatever, and he sends out texts. Like Literally, he just said, the new song's out. Go stream it. Brad, I'm filming a video. Please leave me alone. Okay, so first thing are these white jean shorts. They're from H&M. They are just white and distressed. Super cute for summertime. Um, they just came out of the dryer, so they're like wrinkled and stuff. Um, but don't worry, I steam everything. Um, everything will be good to go before it ships, but everything is clean. Oh. Oh. Okay, I was like, what is this? Like, is that a stain? Um, this pocket doesn't have one, but it looks like that's supposed to be there. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, so I, I've washed everything, um, and everything is clean when it's shipped to you. Um, so just throwing that out there, but it might be wrinkled because it just came out of the dryer, but I will steam it. Don't worry. Next we have a Lululemon scuba hoodie. I might keep this for myself. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is in really, really good condition. It's just a black scuba. It's a size six. And yeah, it's really nice. I might keep it for myself. I might, I might, I might. Um, but yeah, really, really good condition. Lululemon scuba, just a classic. What, baby? Okay, next I have a uh, hoodie from Victoria's Secret. This is a size medium. Looks like this, just has a pink logo on it. It does have some pilling, so I do need to take my sweater shave it to it, but uh, should be good after that. No stains or anything. Okay, another pink Victoria's Secret hoodie. This one is a size small. I like the color on this. Really cute. Okay, another pink Victoria's Secret hoodie. This is size medium. Really pretty bright blue color. This is cute. If I wore cropped stuff, I would totally wear this. Um, another Victoria's Secret pink hoodie, size medium. It's just a cropped sweatshirt. Really, really good condition. It's like super soft. So this is like almost um, like new without tags condition. So cute. How cute would that look? Like when I'm like super pregnant, if I wear like a cropped sweatshirt with my belly hanging out. I could totally start a trend. So this is really cute. I was really excited about this. It's Victoria's Secret Pink, size large. It's a like jacket. Oh my gosh, how cute is that? And then it says pink on the back. This is like sweatshirt material here, but this part is like windbreaker material. Um, but this is in really, really like excellent condition. It just doesn't have the string for the hood. Might keep this for myself. So this is um, by Anvil. It is a Tahoe or Lake Tahoe, California sweatshirt. It's a size medium. I just really like the graphic on it. I might be keeping this for myself. I really like this. I like the color too. And it's got a mousse on it too. I really like it. I might keep it for myself. I don't know. I like it. I like it. It reminds me of like, it's like very Patagonia-esque, you know? Super cute Topshop shorts. So cute. They are a size six. But yeah, really cute. I don't know if you can see, but they have like little buttons right here, little gold buttons, and then a zipper in the back. Super cute for summer. So this has got some stains on it. I just have to bleach it, and I'm pretty sure they will come out. Um, I don't know the brand, but it's just a Newport Beach, um, a Newport Beach cropped uh, uh, sweatshirt. <laughs> but yeah, it's got a couple stains on the front. I need to bleach it. Um, I don't know the sizing on this. I would say probably a small, maybe. This is amazing. This is a vintage t-shirt by Jerseys. This is a Duncan Hines milk chocolate chip cookies t-shirt, like graphic t-shirt. <laughs> and then on the back it says, a day of excellence, June 3rd, 1988. Ooh, I was three years old when this shirt came out. But yeah, it is um, single stitch. 
that's one of the ways to tell that it's vintage. You can also tell by the tag, like totally a vintage tag. Um, yeah, just a cool shirt, Duncan Hines, yeah, yeah. I love Duncan Hines, like cupcakes and cookies and just everything. I have a uh, tank top, this is Victoria's Secret Sport tank top. This is a size medium, super cute. And then it's got that in the back. This will be really cute for summertime. Never mind. I was gonna say I might be keeping these shorts for myself, but they are too big for me. Okay, so these are just American Eagle um, denim shorts. They are a size eight, and they look like that. Really cute. We have another T-shirt. This is Adidas Extra Large. Um, this is not vintage or anything, but I just really liked the. Um, I don't know, I just really like the way it looked and I wish it was smaller so I could wear it because I just, I like it, I like it, I like it, I like it. So this is a uh, men's extra large. I will provide measurements on my um, Poshmark closet, but yeah, men's extra large. And the Duncan Hines one, I'll have to provide measurements. That one's definitely vintage, so the sizing, even though it says extra large, it might be unisex extra large. Um, and the sizing back then was, you know, a little different, so measurements, check the measurements. Okay, Victoria's Secret pink hoodie. <laughs> Medium. Hold on. Let me zip it up. Let me zip it up. Where did the zipper go? Where did the zipper go? What the fuck? There's no zipper on this. <laughs> like, there's a zipper, but there's no, like, zippy zip zip. All right. So, I am pretty sure I unzipped it before I put it in the wash, but I'm going to just go to the listing and check to see. Oh, it's totally zipped up in the picture. It's totally zipped up in the picture. It must have, I would have heard it if it like fell out in my wash. Anyway, um, I guess I'll show it to you. If someone wants to buy it without the zipper. It says uh, true pink love on the back. Looks like that and then it says 86 right here. Um, yeah, I'm gonna look for the zipper. But again, I would have heard it if it came out in the wash, so I don't know. We have some AG jeans. These are the Stilt Cigarette Leg Jeans. These are size 28. Um, there are some stains on these jeans. Well, first of all, we got distressing in the leg here, and then there are some stains right here. I'm gonna try to get those out. Um, if not, I'm just gonna sell them, you know, as is. Or, you know what I could do? You know what I'm probably gonna do, actually? Actually, what I'm going to do is I'll just distress right here. Like, I'll just make two holes right here. That's what I'm gonna do, because these are really, really nice jeans otherwise. They're in like, really, really good condition. So, um, yeah, and I might even do like a raw hem. Otherwise, these are, you know, these are in pretty, pretty decent condition. They do have like fraying at the hem, but I might just make them like a raw hem. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. All right, next we have a tank top from Victoria's Secret Pink. It is a small, and it's a crop tank top. Super cute, super cute. All right, and I got two more shirts that need bleaching. So this is um, a vintage t-shirt. The brand is Flirts. It is a size, uh, I don't know, it doesn't say. Oh, it's one size fits all, okay. Hello, this is like perfect example of a vintage t-shirt. So the tag looks super vintage. The uh, materials, 50% polyester, 50% cotton, and one size fits all. And let's see, single stitch. Uh, yeah, so this is definitely 100% vintage. Um, but it's just a Bugs Bunny shirt in a Santa costume. <laughs> super cute, um, there are some holes in his ear right here, but um, the neck is a little yellow. I'm gonna try to bleach that. I don't know, this is, this is a really, really long t-shirt. This could be like a t-shirt dress. One size fits all, who, th who thought? Who thought that that is a good thing? Doesn't Brandy Melville still do one size fits all? Like, no, that's not, that, no, no. Ooh, it says 1994 on here. So cool. And then this last shirt needs some major, major help with it, but I had to get it because I saw uh, Rally Roots, they recently bought this shirt and I had to get it too. Um, it came, I was in this person's closet and I bundled it with, I think actually I bundled it with the um, Bugs Bunny shirt 
and I don't remember what other things too. The Duncan Hines shirt, maybe? I don't remember. Um, but this is a Disney shirt, and it is Mickey Mouse. Oh, guys, if you didn't know, Mickey Mouse is my favorite like Disney character. But that's what it looks like. Um, it's got some staining in the armpits, um, and just a couple of stains. Um, but I'm, I'm, I'm sure I could bleach it out. But yeah, I really love this shirt. It's got like the Disney tag down here. Um, so yeah, so that shirt needs a little love. The Bugs Bunny shirt needs a little love. Um, but that is it. That is it for the packages that I got in the mail today. That's going to be it for this video. If there's anything that you saw in this video that you want to purchase, check out my Poshmark closet. If you are new to Poshmark and you want to sign up, you can use my code. It is keeping it rad. You get a $10 credit and I also get a $10 credit. So thank you. But yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.